Words of a Piglet. The day I met you first was the day of my birth. Pink and round, me oh so plump. I gaily frolicked with mom. Lovingly, you looked at me praising. Oh, so round, what a cutie. Every day you came by to visit, bringing cool water and delicious veggie treats. Mommy and I were so touched, your kindness more than gold worth. I lived a peaceful life, under your care and protection, growing more plump with each passing day. Just eat, rest, and play. So lovely was this early morn, as clouds were drifting across the sky, cuddling together, Mommy and I, unaware of the befalling tragedy. Two brawny young men, strong like tigers and elephants, squashed my tiny body into a cage of horror. Flat! There was no way to escape. Oh God! What purgatory was this? I wailed in fear and terror. Mom! Oh Mom! Please save me! Oh caretaker, please! Fast! Come protect me! Rescue my life! I'm still at a tender age. Mom was crying out in sorrow, tears of desperation filling her eyes. The immense heavens cannot contain this horrendous, heart-wrenching pain. My caretaker turned away, hands busy counting a stack of money. Haplessly, I rolled around in the car trunk, breaking heart more painful than bodily misery. The two young men bantered, This piglet will be so tasty. Tomorrow we'll slaughter him to celebrate the birth of the wife's newborn baby. Oh... How ironic this life. My soul is shattered. Tears flow in my heart, like blood running in rivulets. I thought you loved me, nurturing me to maturity. But all this was a sham. It's all just about profit and gain. Tomorrow my body will be chopped to pieces. My flesh and bones turned to sheer torture, just so people can laugh and merriment at their happy feast and gathering. Your children and others too, I wish them all long lives so the family can stay together, not endure the same fate as mine. I pray the whole family lives nobly, to be human in many lifetimes and never be reborn as pigs, paying forever karmic debts. Alas, goodbye life, I ache for my gentle suffering mother. In tears, I am overcome. Oh, mommy, mom, mom. The immense pain and suffering of animals, confined and slaughtered for human consumption, are truly unimaginable. Let's pray that more humans quickly open their hearts and minds to the plight of our animal friends and choose the cruelty-free vegan diet.